and good morning. So I've had recent stints on the southwestern and northern regions and now I'm back down on the Chilton areas and today I am at Aylesbury Railway Station and the task for today is to go from Aylesbury to London Marlebone and film all the stations in between with the exception of Wendover because that's already been done before. So I'm looking forward to this one it's gonna be a very very busy day but welcome once again to Down the Line. Aylesbury Railway Station opened to passengers on the 1st of October 1863 by the Wickham Railway Company and is currently managed and operated by Chiltern Railways. Aylesbury does have a great railway history with the links to Metropolitan Line which we will discuss in future episodes and the station also used to be an intermediate station on the old Great Central Main Line until 1966. Here at Aylesbury there are three platforms. Two belong to the Aylesbury to Marlebone line and the other one is the terminus for the line to Princess Risborough. Not only that, um, this station used to be the terminus for the Metropolitan line before it was cut back to Amersham in 1961. And you can tell already by looking around here, history is definitely here. You just gotta look and it's the eye for detail. So let's find some. The line from here in Aylesbury to London Marlebone has a length of 38 miles and takes around an hour to reach the capital, with day return tickets priced at around 22 to 25 pounds. From around 1948 until the 1960s, the station was under the management of British Railways. However, the station had a different name. It was then known as Aylesbury Town until it was changed to what we know it to be today. Okay, so here on platform one, this is the platform to the branch line for Princess Risborough. However, if you want to go down that line, it gives you great connections to the areas of like Vista, Banbury and Birmingham. Um, so there is, like I said, plenty to go from here, not just obviously Aylesbury to Marlebone. Um, and there are quite some cool features here. You know, there's the maintenance and repair depot as well as several sidings. Um, and also I found out recently that there are special services that take it down to the Buckinghamshire railway centre and of course back in history that was connected with the great central main line so they make do and the history does come back here and it's nice to see that they do do that with the future developments of east west rail very much underway it was originally discussed that there would be a connecting line to aylesbury although sadly in 2021 it was announced that the spur to aylesbury would not be going ahead in my opinion, I believe that this should be part of the project as I feel it would bring better connections and better choices for passengers, whereas in my case, I would have to go from Bletchley to London Euston, on the tube to Marlebone and down on the Chiltern line back to Aylesbury. What a pain for any passenger and it really does need to be looked at. In case you're wondering, why have you not started at Aylesbury Vale Parkway? Well, the reason is, um, I want to at least have some more to do at a later date. So, and I know this, like I said, this is the terminus for the line to Princess Risborough and already having done a video at Princess Risborough, I've obviously got Monks Risborough and Little Kimball as well as Vale Parkway. Um, and obviously, like I said, there's some more stations down on that side of the Chiltern line. So again, I don't want to get them all done, you know, in one hit. This, this side's perfectly fine and we're going to come back for the rest. So don't worry, there is more to come. After having already visited Aylesbury on a number of occasions now, it was nice to change my purpose and visit the railway station and look at it in more detail. And this has been a very intriguing start and I can't wait to see what the next eight stations bring me on my journey to London Marlebone. And it'll be nice to view the Chiltern Hills by rail for the first time also. So make sure you return to follow me along my next railway adventure. Hey. So that is the first of nine stations and videos that are going to be coming up. So again, Aylesbury's been a great starting point. Like I said, plenty of history here, as you've heard and seen. Um, but yeah, like I said, we're going to crack on. And the further up the line we go towards the capital is where it all changes from here with extra additions as well. So no, hope you've enjoyed it. And I hope you enjoy the rest that are going to be coming up as well on this stint of the Chilterns. And I'll see you next time down the line. <laughs>